VS Code makes it easy to hide buttons that appear in view toolbars. You can see some of these buttons for the source control view up here, and you'll see that there's quite a few of them in my case. Some of these are coming from VS Code, and other ones are coming from extensions. You might want to consider hiding these buttons if you're wanting a more minimal user interface, or if you have one that's coming from an extension and you're not actively using that button. Let's take a look here at cleaning up the source control view, but this works for other views as well. So if you know the specific button you want to hide, one option is to go up to the button up here, and then right click on it. This will show a context menu that has an option that says hide and then the button name. So in this case, it's hide show commit graph button. And I'll go and click on that. And now the button has been hidden. Now, another option though, is to just go and right click on any button up here. This will show below the hide option at the top, a list of all buttons that can be shown in the view toolbar. So here we have a list of all the possible buttons. The ones that are currently visible have check marks next to them. And you can see that the show commit graph button that we just hit does not have a check mark. So that one is currently hidden. I can now look through the entire list of buttons that are available, find the one that I want to hide. So in this case, I'll go and hide the view commit graph button. And now it's gone and been hidden as well. So just by going up to a button, right clicking on it and either using the hide action or going and checking them off the list here, I can control what buttons are going to be visible. Let's also get rid of one more here. So I'll get rid of the create pull request button as well. Now, when you hide a button, it is not actually gone. You can still access its functionality. It is just no longer being shown inside the view toolbar up here. So let's say that I want to access some of the functionality that one of the hidden buttons offered. I could just go to the dot, dot, dot over here. That is always going to be visible. And then I can select the button from the list here. So if we wanted to run the show commit graph action, which was previously a button, I could go and select this in the list. And now I have the show commit graph um, action and I can see my commit graph over on the editor area here. You can just as easily unhide buttons. So let's say that I hit something like the commit button here. So I'll go hide that one. And now I realize that I actually want to bring that one back. To do that, all I have to do is right click on any of the remaining buttons up here, including on the dot, dot, dot over here. So I'm gonna right click on any of these, and then I can go down to my list of buttons and check the one that I wanna bring back. So again, I wanna bring back the commit button. I'll select this one, and now I have the commit button showing back in my source control view toolbar. So that's a quick look at how you can hide buttons in view toolbars in VS Code. Again, it's a great way to make your user interface a little bit more minimal or get rid of buttons contributed by extensions that you're not using.